What's going on guys, Tom Baker here and welcome back to Dragon Shoe. Last we left. Really After that buff we completed Act 2 and now we're into Act 3 guys. We're heading near nearer to the end of this game. Alright, let's speak to around the nobles. So yeah, noble one. The night command isn't bad. I wish you really were. So do I. Let me just find my remote guys, give me a second. So I can have a little volume. I'll tell you that, yeah. The night command isn't bad. I wish you really were. Yeah. No woman. The Viscount had no heir. Will you take his place, champion? Yes. No. Would you be our Viscount, champion? I know I feel safe with you in this match. <laughs> I've got a daughter in the circle. There's a lot of mages in the city who aren't blood mages. The Knight Commander's getting out of control. Yes. Ooh. Tireless. Many Kunari fell in Kirkwall when we departed. I am sent to gather their swords. If you find a Kunari sword, return it to me. I'll look for them. I'll keep an eye out. You will find me here. The lost swords. Oh, we, we dinged from that last act. Attributes. One, two in constitution, one in magic. We will take... Um, second chance. Alright, let's see. You'll have all three in a willpower, so you can just down those a bit higher. Let's see what we got. Um, disc. I'm going to fix again. 15% damage resistance. Fenris, yes, you'll definitely have three into the power. You're like, you're the damage tank. Battle temp. I think we'll go in a, in a reserve, so we go. Varric, my friend. Two into dexterity. Oops. No. Two into dexterity, one into cunning. Here we go. Uh, we'll finish off this one. Uh, precise criticals. Who's that jumping out the sky? I of Mysterio. Oh. Pick up these quests first, guys, and I'll. I was speaking to Donick the other day. Since when do you talk with my husband? He comes to the mansion once a week. We play Diamondback. What? Why am I not invited to these games? He says you get angry when you lose. I do not. Well, oh, like perhaps I do. Still, that's no reason not to tell me. It is if he's a betting man. I disavow all knowledge of gambling occurring in my household. <laughs> Nuncio. Ah, the champion of Kirkwall. Your reputation precedes you. Yeah. Forgive me. I should introduce myself properly. My name is Nancio Caldera Lanos. I am a noble from the beautiful country of Antiva. That's quite the name. It must have taken a lot of practice to say that all in one breath. It's mostly to impress the ladies, I assure you. <laughs> I've come to ask your help, champion. Hiding among the Dalish is an elven assassin I've been chasing for months. He's a master manipulator who will endanger even his own kind to ensure his survival. Let me guess what, let me guess what comes next. You want me to use my wily, wily ways to find out where the Dalish are hiding this elf? That is part of it, yes. This elf is very dangerous. And he must be brought in before he kills again. I've heard of your dealings with the Dalish. I was hoping you could go where my men could not. Find out where the assassin is hiding and apprehend him. Fine. I'll see what I can do. One of the Dalish, a woman named Variel, is a friend of his. I suggest speaking with her first. We won't be here when you get back. We got a campsite outside the city. Look for us there. Okay. A murder of crows. The Antiban crows. Do they do send their regards to the Dwarven Merchants Guild doesn't seem very lit nowadays. Mind if I try my hand at that? Sure, Barak. If not for the experience, I don't actually care about what's in it. I just want the experience and that opening. Hubert's got another quest for us. Um, 
I'll probably have to tap into this uh, the uh, the DLC stuff I've downloaded because for armor because my, I'm like finding it really difficult. Those ends, yeah, that's the best one I got for you. Um, Fates Fury, it's mm, same one. Shield of a Night Cell, you can have that now. There we are. Hubert. Catastrophe has struck, partner. We are ruined. Ruined. It figures. It's always something with this mine. A guard came back from the ruin pit, half wrecked, with a dozen mangled bodies. The horse pulling the cart was the only survivor, and it does not speak. You should show Town that. full of rotten mages, and not one can get answers from a horse. What would you do without me? I'll check it out. You keep interrogating that horse. I knew I could depend on you. Just like old times, partner. Mine massacre. What is there? Ah, I'll go back to the house. And see who's that jumping out the sky, Adi on um, Mysterio. We've done nothing in six minutes into the recording. Jesus fucking Christ, Jack. Oh, hurry the fuck up. Come on, Jesus. Come on, Sixes. Let's see what we got to do though. Um, companions. We're going to talk to all the companions today and do the first main quest. So, we're going to do a talking to, us, the storm that we came before, check on Anders, champions, captain, speak to Fenris of the new place, and faith. There's a gambling food mask. Jesus Christ, there's so many stuff to do. We need rescuing. And lost souls. I'm getting the right name. Check out this. On the loose. Champion, I require your assistance in a matter of great urgency. Please report to the Templar Hall in the gallery at your earliest convenience. Sincerely, Knight Commander Merrick. It means rescuing. Champion, you simply must help me. Help me. My daughter Olana was abducted by foul bandits. One of my servants discovered she was taken somewhere on the Wunga coast. I bid you make haste, for I fear these low-born scum will take her maidenhood. That would make the arrangement of a suitable marriage for her very difficult. Please return my line to me in text, Renegal Daya Spinter. Mr. Hoch, maybe you don't remember me. We met briefly, and though it was the most important moment of my life, you've changed so many lives that you probably can't keep them all straight. You rescued me from Sir Ulric, and you told me to leave Kirkwall. I want to tell you that I have, and I won't say where I am now but I'm free and I'm not looking back. I heard the rumours terrible days are coming. I pray for the safety of my family and all my souls and Kirkwall especially for you. And just to keep me and just to keep you from harm, sincerely Anna. A letter from Tervinta, eh? Hey, it's very real. Dear Hawk, or is it now Champion Hawk? The story of how you handled the Irish Hawk is very popular here. There are a few things that the love more than a tale of canary defeat. They say the Imperium is a strange place would be a very underestimated very understatement. Men and women work magic in the streets while these slaves look on. I w watched my own master kill a rival magister in a duel just days ago. Sometimes I look around and I think I understand the Templars back in Kirkwall. My studies are going well. My dreams won't trouble me as much these days. I'm hopeful that in time I'll master myself. I just wanted to thank you. I owe you more than my life. I owe you my mind and my future. Fainrio. No. A letter from Orsino. Champion, you deserve your new title, despite what Knight Commander Meredith might prefer. Okay. You and I both know what would have happened had you not been there to face the Kanai. I'm sure you've received no shortage of accolades from the powers that be in the city. But what it's worth, I'm sending a gift from the Circle of Magi to use it well. Regards, First Enchantment Yeah, I'm not going to read that as well. On the loose. Good deal with the dog. Puppy. 
What did the wardrobe do? I'm sure the furniture's very sorry for whatever it did, old boy. Something in the wardrobe. All right. Let's see. Please don't open the door. You've caught a burglar. Good boy. <laughs> My legs are cramping. Please just let me go. You're going to jail. It's the dungeons for you. Go fetch a watchman, boy. Go in the fetch the watch. Dogs aren't that smart. Right? Smarter than you, anyway. <laughs> Lol. Puppy. Oh, pee. I'm sorry about the mother. I will miss her. Oh. Highton is such a strange place. It feels like it's miles away from everywhere else. Alienage, Sundermount, Ferelden, those could be from a dream. Ah, oh, Mahavinan, I didn't see you there. I'm going to visit the Alienage. Do you want anything from Lotan? Say hi to the beggar for me. I almost miss Lotan. I haven't had my pocket picked in ages. It's such a friendly gesture. Sticking your hand in someone else's pocket. The Dalish are never that familiar. I'm stopping by my house for a bit. That's all. I've left some things undone there. I'll be back later. Just bring your stuff here. If you just move in all your stuff, you wouldn't have to keep going there. It's better if some things stay away from this house. Back before dark, I promise. Meryl? Meryl? What? Hey, your puppy. Alright. Where is it? The apostate's legacy. Ah. Bedding some stuff. Simple as that. Like say Malcolm's honor, Malcolm's request, the apostate's mask, fugitive gauntlets, the long track. I'll take that, I'll take that, I'll take that. Let's see the stuff we've got. Malcolm's honor. I'll use it because it improves with level up. Alright, and then we'll use get the ropes on. Malcolm Bequest is like so much better. The Apostate Mask is so much better. Where are the gauntlets? Where's the chair? Oh. Be... My users. You suck. Fugitive Gauntlets. Bloods of the Champion. OP. The Long Trek. You are so crap. So there. Yeah. Special deliveries. Grip. Mm. No ding. I got myself a ding. Attributes. Two points. Forty-six magic. Oh my god. Um. Oh my god, I just like got a quick glance at us. We look epic as fuck, man. We look cool. Yeah, Isabel's gone forever. So it's cut up my colours. Not really. Uh, we'll go to Meryl's home. Let's go speak to Meryl again. We'll go to Meryl, Varric, Fenris, Abilene, and Sebastian. You shouldn't be stuck in this rat trap. Does Hawk even know you're here? I don't have to ask permission to come to my own house, Beric. Just take a walk around the low town market. Get some air and I'll stop bothering you. I know you mean well, but I have too much to do right now. I 
let you talk some oh, sense into hello, Hawk. Beric is very sweet, frequently infuriating and a terrible busybody, but sweet. I probably should have told Bodan where I was going. I hope I didn't worry you. Worried about worrying me? Beryl, is there anything that doesn't make you nervous? Flowers and bunnies, maybe? What about poison flowers? Or, or, or dire bunnies? In the market the other day, out of the corner of my eye, I thought I saw Tamlin. I blinked, and he was gone. I don't know what it meant. Maybe nothing. Maybe I'm going mad. I miss them all. Even the Keeper. <laughs> they probably miss you too. I'm sure the Keeper would like to see you again. I'm sure she would. She loves the lecture. I bet her new first appreciates that. I wish I could have seen it. It doesn't matter. I'm here now. Maybe Varric was right. Shall we go out for a bit? I could use some sunshine. <laughs> That's my girl. Beyond the Veil, Spirits and Demons. This. This. Oh my. Oh, I, lo I love this. I love this suit we've got on. It looks so cool. It actually looks. Oh, boys. Boys, boys we hit the jackpot. Here's my. It just won't go to high tap. Hang, hang man. There we go. I'm like for me, but oh my god, boys, we have hit the jackpot on this armor. It looks epic. So we go in here. Fenris, Abilene, Anders, Sebastian, and then we'll do the main quest. We'll speak to, we'll speak to the pioneers in this episode and start the main quest next episode. Supposed to be to Varric. Hello. Varric. If you think that was bad, I should tell you about the Black Marsh. Remember <laughs> <laughs> that? See, when you say things like that, Blondie, it just makes me glad I didn't know you sooner. Who goes to a place named Black Marsh on purpose? Now, they called it Beer Marsh. No, still doesn't work. You've got a point. The marsh part does cancel out anything else. Flower marsh, kitten marsh. No, no good. Ah, you've got company. I'll see you later. Mark, what can I do for you? What was Anders here? What was Anders here for? Only place in Kirkwall he can get a decent drink. Blondie comes by here and I put him on my tab. He's got some stories about his days in Ferelden that sound implausible, even to me. He's not bad for a mage. Crazy, but that's most everyone in this city. Why don't you buy me a drink? I wouldn't say no to a pint. I should make you buy the drinks, oh champion of Kirkwall. <laughs> so, what's the word in Lowtown, Barrick? Nothing you don't know already. The Viscount's departure, a vacuum of power, troubles brewing. Get rid of one thread and another appears. I'm starting to think this city's in love with Crisis. Hope you're ready for it, my friend. I'm keeping Bianca close. Fair enough. The storm and what came before it. I'm Ooh, Maraz. A face to forget, but do I know you, Kunari? Count the shop, once of the wounded coast. I had left my fellow. You convinced me to turn on them. It was long ago. I am now Maraz, mercenary of Kirkwall. Time has been kind to your name, champion. <laughs> Are you available for hire? So, interested in some work? Yes, but not with you. Why? I do not work for those with titles. They do not have jobs. They have causes. When you stand for more, more stand against you. There are a few of you left here. I'm surprised to see any Kunari or Tava shop in the city. The Kunari died with the Irish shop because they believed they were meant to. Many Tava shop were also killed, just in case. Time has calmed those fears. Now I am hired as much for my appearance as my skill. 
Life is comfortably empty. I see the appeal. Goodbye. Farewell, then. Panehedan, Sirao. Panehedan, Maras. Need that, right? Alright, let's go speak to Abalin Fallen. Alright, guys, I'm setting the time for it here. 25 minutes. Oh, my back actually sound awake. Yeah. Uh, well, eh. Why is it the uh, screen noise, guys? That is the chair I'm sitting on. Chair, I say, I say, chair bed. I'm sitting on my bed. Aveline Valen. Guardsman, duties for the week will be low town canvas. Five on, three off. City perimeter by twos. Clear by second watch. Training recruits full metal by week's end. Anything else, Captain? No. Thank you. <laughs> Sarah Hawk. Donicus, a good man. I'm sorry, was there something you wanted? Anything going on? Just checking in. Need anything? Yes, there's something. Come back soon. I'll get into it then. Goodbye. I'll see you later. Of course, Hawk. That's all you that's all I had to do. Champions, captains. Champions and captains. Hello again, champion. Hello. Hello. It's me you're looking for. I can see it in your eyes. I can see it up above. Hello. <laughs> That's so bad. <laughs> that just fly out, man. Oh. <sighs> PlayStation should the fuck up. <laughs> Actually, listen to this song. You're making noise. I have to defend this one. I have to defend this. We've got two more to go. What? The maker's first children. Fenris. Are you certain it's her? An elf matching your description on the ship you named. And alone, as far as I could tell. I need to know if it's a trap. I did as you asked, Fenris. Now it's up to you. You talk to him, Hawk. I've had my fill for today. Then he is fast of us. Problems? Maybe it's just me, but I'd swear you're upset. Nah, it's my sister. I didn't tell you, but I followed up on Adriana's information. Everything she said was true. I had to keep it quiet, but I eventually contacted Verania and sent her coin enough to come meet me. And now she's here. So what's the problem? Yes, everything's gone exactly according to plan. What could be worse? Yes, yes, laugh at me. Come with me, Hawk. I need you there when I meet her. Let's go. Where is she? If we go to the Hanged Man during the day, she'll be there. For the next week, at least. It would mean a lot to me. That's all I ask. Alone. We'll do that another time, guys. We'll do that another time, session. Because it's a companion quest. So, in Faith's also a companion quest, guys, so we'll do that in another episode. But we're going to speak to Sebastian. I know we're going to go over the time. We'll go speak to Sebastian in, in two anders. I'll go as quick as I can. With the first six minutes, we've got barely anything done. Well, we got three secondary quests. And, uh, going back to the mansion. That's what we did in six minutes. Yep, it's fast, yeah. Sebastian Vale. Do you never intend to give a public answer, Your Grace? What have I been asked? About the mages. 
You could calm this fire if you stepped forward. The Chantry's teachings are clear. Those who turn against them would not listen more to me than to Andraste. Not more mage debates. Mage this, Templar that. Is there anywhere in Kirkwall people don't talk about this? The last time mages rebelled against the Chantry, they ended up ruling Tavinta. Should we just ignore them? I did not expect things to deteriorate so fast. I thought after the Canari, no one would wish for more violence. It has drawn more attention than I would like. Sebastian, if I can ask... Anything, Your Grace. And the champion, too, if you will. Anything you ask. I am your humble servant. You honor me. The Divine is concerned about the situation here. She does not want to see the Free Marches become another Imperium. She has sent an agent to assess the danger. Meet with her, please. Tell her drastic measures won't be required. Of course. I don't want to see the Divine's armies march against Kirkwall. Surely the Divine wouldn't treat the whole city as enemies. She is concerned. It is never wise to draw the concern of the powerful. She is the voice of Andraste. She cannot turn them. We're no innocence harm. We'll do right now. All right. The room. Yeah, it's that voice. We got it. You know, we'll gather. We'll gather our party. You know. Sebastian's friendship plus twenty-five. Sebastian, the last three years in the Codex. What man cares about personality? Greetings, champion. You're too quiet. And this is a clinic. After the clinic, put me off, yeah. I'll have to speak to Anders. <sighs> Come on. Load game, I know you can load. Oh, God, man. Mm -hmm. We met most of our goals in the year. We didn't meet a few, but it was alright. We met most of them. I'm um, going to the year. My recording sessions, I met most of them. But it was good. I think <laughs> I got flooded you with too much Dragon Age 2. But hey, it's almost done, so why not flood you with more? Anders. You think I don't know the city guard is just another arm of the Templars? That is completely unfair. If they show up here, I'll know who to blame. That's all I'm saying. I'm sorry. I didn't mean for you to see that. I just can't be too careful. Now that the Knight Commander has basically appointed herself Viscount. She's a busy lady. Between ruling the city and torturing mages, it's a wonder she has time to keep that sword so shiny. She has nearly crushed the flame of hope for mages here. The mage underground is all but destroyed, and those left have turned to blood magic as their only option, which Meredith knows will prevent any chance of the public taking their side. There's still hope. There's still us. I don't know how you continue to believe in me. How can people be so blind? The blight was stopped only with the aid of two mages, one an apostate. But it makes no difference. The Chantry set us on this path long ago. It would take something truly catastrophic to change people's thinking now. Oh yeah, Morrigan and Wynn. The two mages. Now guys, with that, we will cut the video off here. So as always, hope you guys enjoy it, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys. Okay, bye.